Hi everybody, it's Andy from Inside the Music. And in case you're not aware of it, I do an interview series called Five and Five. And what I did today was I took clips from each of those interviews I did and I made you a video to check out. And if you're interested after checking out the video and you'd like to do an interview with me, you can hit me up at ohstudio.usa at gmail.com. Once again, that's ohstudio.usa at gmail.com. And we'll set up a time and date so you can get an interview done with me. All right. Y'all take care. Bye. Well, I, my idea behind this uh, interview um, was to, and I'll let everyone know, this is uh, my first interview. And Robbie is, is, is my uh, you know, guinea pig. <laughs> and there you go. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, um, I, I have a, a list of questions here. Let's go to question number one, if you don't mind. Yeah. So we got, uh, what software or hardware do you use for music production and why? Well, uh, do you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior Reaper? <laughs> <laughs> and and then what about well, what about you? Because you're you're also a songwriter. You have some really great songs on Spotify. Thank you. Y'all need to check his music out. Uh, it's really good. He sings. He sings very well. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Something I'm not proficient at. <laughs> and I love your voice, dude. Um, Thank and you, that's man. an important uh, important thing to have a uh, talent. So, um, anyways, but how? When you when you write a song, is there a do you have a strategic way you go about it, or do you just start strumming on like me strumming on a guitar? Ooh, I like that. You keep it. Yeah, I think. I mean, I think I always. I never really write lyrics on their own. I always sort of write it with the guitar in mind as well. I can't tell you which one comes first, really, because perhaps one inspires the other, and and then I'm not really too. I don't. A lot of people are like, oh, I do this first, do that. I just do whatever. I'm sure I've done both, <laughs> and um, and yeah, that's kind of how it starts um for me. So always with a guitar, always with a guitar in my lap, and yep. messing around with some chord ideas, and and then seeing that's... where the inspiration takes me from there. That, that's pretty much my technique Again, too, today so. i have with me chris salem from mixed down online he also has an academy uh, if you haven't uh, had an opportunity yet to check it out i highly suggest you look it up on the internet chris can you give them uh where they can find that information yeah straight on my uh, on my website mixdown.online that simple you know so all courses and the uh uh, the page to get into the membership which is closed right now okay not the membership itself but the registrations okay so it, i open that a couple times a year so just important to be on the mailing list or the waiting list for the mixed down coaching community all right let's go on to question number five the first five of five and five so and finally question number five could you share a particularly rewarding experience or feedback you've received from your audience regarding your videos. Um, it's all it, it's it's always the same. You know, you help me a lot. You know, with my my music. Um, I, I remember a few like a few months ago, someone's sending me like a vinyl copy of their album. Oh, you know, wow. that's because of you. You know, I, I went through your course, and there you go. It's not perfect, but you know, I released it. It's there. Can I send it to you? Cool. Oh. Yeah. Wow, that's sweet. That's it is. Awesome. Yeah, that's it. That's inspiring for you. I say to keep it is going forward. <laughs> big time, big time. So that's like okay, cool. Yeah, well, because like transformation is what I'm. You know, this is what rewards me is when I see people being transformed, right? Their production mixing skills or whatever they do in the studio right. by watching my tutorials or when when uh, through my courses and you know. So yeah. if I can help make them better and make them release music, they can right. be proud of. Right, man, mission accomplished. Well, and that's I, a cool thing so with with the the uh, the mix down coaching community. Mm -hmm. I mean, we listen to a bunch of mixes that people are actually going to release. Right, right, yeah, you know? one of those. And I like that, <laughs> and you're yeah. one of them exactly. Yeah, 